Yo guys, Theo here on Common Sense. Today I'm gonna tell you how to make weight loss fun, you know. Most people don't think it's so fun to go on a diet, having to cut fat, having to stay away from junk food, but I'm gonna tell you how it's done. So what you do is you buy a ticket to Candyland where fart smells like roses and shit tastes like chocolate pudding and you just go there and boom, your weight loss will be fantastically enjoyable and fun. Like what did you expect? There's a reason you have to look into how do I lose weight. There's a reason people have to try and fail and give up even. It's because it's not fun. It's not fun. If it, would, if it was fun, it would be easy. Everyone would be lean. Everyone would be ripped if it was fun. So I want to tell you this just so you can embrace the fact. You know, I, I started thinking about a client I sort of inherited when I was working as a PT in the gym. You know, most clients you get, they have some kind of trial session and then you agree upon something. But this was a client I inherited from a colleague who, who killed herself, actually. Very sad I didn't get to know her that well, but it was sad. But anyway, I inherited this client, so I didn't know who it was. So when I meet her, she's very fat, what I call USA fat. Like in Sweden, it's unusual that people are that fat. And I'm a little like, you know, oh, I wasn't expecting that. We had a sort of introductionary, ah, oh, my shoulder is just dead. I'm working out here in the beach. Introductionary talk, you know, I'm like, okay, what are your goals, blah, blah. And she mentions basically everything except weight loss. Like, oh, I wanna be stronger, I wanna be, feel good, blah, blah, blah. And so I'm a little, you know, I wasn't prepared, so I don't say anything about the weight now and I do some session with her but the next time you know I'm that sort of guy you know I wouldn't just go up to a stranger in the street and be like oh you're fat you shouldn't be but when I am the trainer of someone who is morbidly obese I can't play along and pretend as if yeah 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 let's the, the, what we're doing in the gym here it's totally making a difference for you right because it isn't when you're that fat it's great that you strength train too but you're gonna have to do some kind of dieting weight loss protocol so I take this up with her that, you know, last time when I asked you about your goals, you mentioned basically everything about weight loss. And, you know, I'm sorry, I don't want to step on any toes to that, but you, you clearly need to lose weight. Like, if you want to feel good and all that, like you talked about, you got to lose weight. So I started talking to her about, have you tried this and this and this? And she was all like, yeah, but I, I didn't feel good for that, from that. Like, no, 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 I didn't want to do it. I went, no, no, I didn't feel good from that. So I, I'm looking for a way for me, you know, she's saying. And like this, this was one of those cases, you know, I had to just give up on it and just do it. Well, okay, at least I can take her through some workouts, you know. But that's the thing. <laughs> Expecting that you're going to find a way that like feels good for you with something that doesn't feel good. Weight loss doesn't feel good. You know, the training, training, we can enjoy some aspects of not every workout, not all the time, but it can be fun, like hitting PRs or feeling I'm getting better at this exercise and oh, I feel like a beast now. Wow, that was a great set. But you can't really enjoy like, yeah, this calorie deficit. It's, it's such a ride, you know, oh, finishing this plate and still being a little bit hungry. Mm, sure enjoying this. It's like, yeah, it's a mindset thing. I talk about that you should be like, oh, this is what weight loss feels like, you know, so you can kind of change your perspective, but it's just not going to be fun, no matter how you look at it. Like fasting, so I'm waking up like, oh, I sure would like to eat. How fun that I still have two days of not eating to do. It's not going to be fun, whatever you do. That's what we got to realize. Embrace it. Embrace it. It has to suck right now. Like that other video I put out, it just has to. Like, if anything feels wrong, that you just, you know, I, I have a similar thing going with my workout today. I didn't feel like it at all. I don't feel motivated at all. My my mind wants to quit it so many times, you know. My mind comes, oh, we don't have to today, but you're on point to you. Just do a couple cells. You can go, blah, 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 blah. But that's the fucking thing. Uh, like, sometimes it's just not enjoyable. Even a workout, that's when it's the most important to do. It's a free ride. Otherwise, well, let's not go off topic, but you see, that's another example of this. I realized that, oh, yeah, 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 I'm just going to have to fight this fucking thought and feeling I, I don't want to. It's not fun. Today, I don't like one. Eh. Okay, that's how it's going to be now. If I want to stay jacked, if I want to keep improving, I can't just do what I think is fun and feels good. That's, I'm never going to get anywhere then. But it's even more true for weight loss. Like fasting, and when you, like me, have done it a lot and you've adapted more, there are definitely, and I know all people can have like ad times during a fast when they feel really good, you know, and that. Um, but 
so you know, yeah, okay, uh, but, but in general, like when I uh, go, uh, go on, when I bulked and I'm actually going to do some more consistent fasting, cut weight, like the last time I did every other week, 60 hour fast. You know, every time when the fast comes, it's like, ah, here comes the boring part, you know, but that's what I have to do. I'm, I'm just not going to feel excited, like, yes, this is going to be so fun to not do shit, not train, not eat on these days or not train heavy at least, you know, and it's going to be so much fun. Embrace it. And I'll end on this note. What is really awesome, I've been horrible at looking at the space on the memory card before recording recently, but I'll end on this note. What is great about weight loss is that it comes a time when it's over, not the time that, you know, that's not what I feel. It's not the time where you can just go back to eating like shit and not caring about your diet. But there will be a time when you've reached the goal and you don't have to lose weight. You don't have to be in this deficit and you can actually enjoy eating more and training harder. Now training for putting on muscle, you know, you don't have to do this like, oh, I'm a bit hungry. I have to go to bed a bit hungry. Uh, I feel like eating more, but I can't. It's all over when you're there and then you're there and you can enjoy that and you know that's what uh, i i put on a decent amount of fat last year like consciously uh, i'm never gonna do that again not that much but you know it sucked the weight loss process sucked but when i got closer to the goal and i see more and more definition i'm like yeah and then i'm at a point like i'm fucking done it's over and i look great I have a new level up shape and I don't have to do this fucking boring thing again. I, I, now I can just enjoy eating and training for progress. So that's the takeaway. You know, it has to suck. There's no way to make the weight loss fun like that. But it's a lot of fun at the end. And then it's over. You're done. If you don't go back to your old ways, of course, but you shouldn't. Don't be an idiot. Okay, guys, please leave a comment. What did you think? Please like. All comments and likes help support the channel. So it's very much appreciated. I'm taking on coaching clients. You can apply via my website. Um, yeah, it's in the description or DM me on Instagram. Usually quicker to respond there, actually. But either way, it's fine. And please subscribe for more content about fitness, fasting, losing weight, building muscles, self improvement, stoicism, mental health, philosophy, mindset. It's a mindset, guys. It's boring. It's fucking boring, but it's rewarding when you get there. Okay, guys, peace.